Hello viewers, this Dot Too Fast here. Now recently I've been shopping around for a foam mount for my vehicle. And if you look on Amazon or eBay, there are tons of styles and design you can choose from. I know there are a couple of styles I do not want to use. One type is a vent mount that you clip into the vent. The reason I don't like this style is because during winter, when you're blowing hot air, I don't want that hot air blowing onto the phone. And during summer, when you have the cold air blowing out, I'd rather have the cold air blowing into the cabin and not being blocked by the phone. The other type of mount I don't want is windshield mount. I prefer not having anything block my view while I'm driving. The third type of mount you'll find is one that sticks on your dashboard. And typically these are quite bulky. I don't think it looks very nice. And you also have the problem with the phone blocking your view. So I decided to go with this magnetic mount and I really like it. It's compact, well-made, and best of all, it's very easy to use. Let me show you this magnetic mount. Let's have a closer look at this mount. Now this entire piece is made of solid metal. It's actually quite heavy. It's not made of plastic, so you don't have to worry about this cracking or breaking on you. Now if you look at the middle here, there's a metal ball joint. And this will allow you to adjust the angle of your phone. It's quite stiff. You don't want it loose because if you're driving on a bumpy road, you don't want the angle of the phone change on you. On the front is a rubberized surface so it won't scratch your phone. Now behind it are four very strong magnets. That's what helps to hold the phone in place. Now it comes with these two metal discs. So you install this onto the back of your phone. And when you place a phone onto the mount, it'll hold it in place. Looking at the back, it's a 3M double sided tape. You can stick this onto your dash. They've also included an extra 3M double sided tape for the bottom. And these are alcohol wipes to clean the surface. Install the metal plate on the back of your phone case. Put it right in the middle right here. First clean the surface with rubbing alcohol. Remove the backing on a double side tape. Press on it and hold it for a minute. Remove the protective film on the top. As you can see, it doesn't add any thickness to the phone. Here's my other phone with the plate installed. They've also included this clear plastic sticker. If you want to install the metal plate directly onto the back of your phone, you can first install this clear sticker and then stick the metal plate on top of it. This way it will be easier to remove the metal plate without damaging your phone. When it comes to installing this, choose a surface in your vehicle that has a smooth finish like right here or here. This will work fine also. So you can stick this directly on the surface. Now if you choose a location that has a textured finish, there's a chance it might not stick on it very well and might come off. If this is the only spot you have in your vehicle, what you'll need to do is clean the surface with rubbing alcohol very well before installing it. If you need to replace a double sided tape, remember it comes with a spare one that you can use. In this Honda Odyssey, I've decided to put the mount right in this location. Use rubbing alcohol or the included wipes to clean the surface. Now after you put it on, hold it down and put some pressure on it for a couple of minutes. This is very sturdy, it's not going to move around. You can adjust the angle that you want. Using it is very simple. Just place a phone on the mount. You can rotate it. I really like it, so I also installed one in my Nissan Pathfinder. This also makes it very convenient to plug in your charge cable. Overall, I really like this new car mount. It's compact, easy to install, and very simple to use. You can easily adjust the angle that you need, and it's a solid unit. You don't have to worry about it breaking after a couple of months. Now, you'll find this foam mount sold under different brands, and the price ranges from $14 to $19. I'll list all the links in the description below. You can choose whichever one you want. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, remember to click on a thumbs up, and if you're not already subscribed, Please click on the subscribe button to support this channel. Also click on the notification bell so you'll get notified of my new videos. Thank you and have an awesome day.